Yeah, the thing is that, that uh, I played this game since eight years. When I started, we were maybe six, seven tennis players, and we had like some moments I think we never gonna forget, especially when we were bad players. We were laughing, it was unbelievable. Hello guys, I'm Daniel Medvedev, and I'm very excited because right now I'm in New York, and it's my first uh, press conference for Rainbow Six Siege, a game I play since uh, many years, almost uh, since it went out, so I'm really happy and excited to share this news with you. Rainbow Six Siege is a tactical shooter. It's a 5v5, attackers against defenders. Straight from the beginning, it's a lot of fun and I feel like you can improve every day and learn something new every day. Before Rainbow Six Siege, I was not a shooter game guy. And uh, at one moment, my friends told me there is a new game that is going to launch called Rainbow Six Siege. You have to play with us. And then uh, probably two, three months in, they were only playing this. So I was like, if I want to play with my friends, I have to get into it. And as soon as I started, I never stopped. I really loved it from, uh, from the first time. I think it's not easy like any game to be a beginner. It can be compared to tennis in a way where if you pick up the racket for the first time, maybe you're going to have fun, but you're probably not going to make one ball in the court. And uh, the more you play, the better you become and the more fun it becomes. Then when you win and you start to improve and uh, get better, it's super rewarding and that's the best feeling ever. I think uh, both in tennis and seat you need to be precise and strategic at the same time. You come up with a plan, you think that it's the best plan ever, but you have to adapt to what your opponent has to offer you because they probably think they have the best plan ever too. Game to game, set to set, uh, match to match in Siege, you have to come up with something new sometimes if your opponent surprises you. It's, in my opinion, completely the same thing when uh, you play Siege and Tennis in terms of competitive spirit. Every game you play, even if it's not ranked, but especially if it's ranked, you want to win. And that's what I like. I play computer games to have fun, but also to have this sense of competition, which uh, I like all the time in my life. Tennis is a big part of it. And then when I have time to, to do something fun outside of tennis, if I can still have this feeling of uh, winning, it's very important. And that's what I get in Siege. When I think about uh, my partnership, it's very, very important for me to, to be connected to the brand I'm going to partner with. So, as I said, with Rainbow Six Siege, it's a dream come true to partner with, uh, with the game you love. So I'm really happy that uh, it became uh, the reality. When Daniel came to the studio, it was amazing to see him like interact with devs, uh, with designers, telling them like what's going right, what's going wrong, what he sees as some things that can be improved because he knows the game. So he has that common language that we speak. So Daniel for us is going to be helping us promoting seasons, but also using his imagery also within the game through uh, the skins that we will be uh, releasing. And this is a way for us uh, and for our community to grow and go beyond what we have uh, today. I'm uh, very excited for the community to see that I'm playing this game and to challenge me. It's going to be a lot of fun and I would be really, yeah, we're really happy to play against other Siege players.